Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. Today I bring you my favorite products. Um, I want to share with you this stuff. I love the most and I just obsess with this product. I love this makeup products because you can see I constantly playing with it and I create different looks for the morning, for evening. And yeah, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Let's get started with the Pam McGrath eyeshadow palette. This is the Mother She Sunly Seduction. The packaging is absolutely stunning. Such a beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous eyeshadow palette. I love the packaging. You know, like Pam, you know, Pam McGrath. We all her mother chips. She just always like very inspiring. When I see this look over here, and it's like I want to do it. Anyway, I recreate this look not with this palette, but with another mother she the Utopian Dream. And oh my god, I have shadow like all over here. I smoke it out very well. And I apply like glitters on the top and the center. And I apply the liquid lipstick on my lips and some red glitter that I do have by Pomegranate. So super excited every time I see this packaging. It's like I want to go back to create these crazy looks because it's so cool. But then after a few hours, I had to remove it because I was like, where am I going to go? <laughs> so it's just no point to, to have something like this to go out. You know what I mean? I would look kind of crazy. But I swear. Every time she comes with this mother she and she comes like with a new mother she she comes with this packaging that inspires me in so many good ways. Like in such a good way. You have no idea. Anyway, I'm gonna show you the palette. It looks like this. I'm obsessed in love with these four like astral shades. You know, they're very special, they're amazing. I'm obsessed with these matte shades, you have no idea. And these colors over here. I'm in love because this one is like the perfect brow bone shade and for the inner tear to kind of create light dimension on your eyes. Amazing. This shadow is such a beautiful shadow. There's no fall off whatsoever. This matte brown here is so beautiful. Oh my God, I love to apply this color like underneath. Mm. Beautiful. Underneath my lower lash line. I love it on the crease. I like to intensify the shadow with this one on the outer B. I love it. The shimmer, these shimmers over here, they are not like shimmer. They're like satin, kind of like satin texture. I love them. Beautiful, gorgeous palette. Obsessed, obsessed with these four gorgeous astral shades. Ah, the pigmentation. It's like, I feel like there's no a camera out there that give justice to these four shadows over here i mean this palette is absolutely stunning i'm in love and i hope you got it because pam mcgrath has like a 30 40 percent off right now in her website i don't know this palette is gorgeous 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 like i have nothing nothing to say i love love this palette and i feel like between this one and the one that came last year this one is much better like this is gorgeous like i'm obsessed if you see my eyes you know, I had this like um, activated aligners that you activate with water. Um, I want to talk about them because I got them a few weeks ago and I've been obsessed playing with these. I've been creating different eye look with makeup and then I go and create like crazy aligners. Um, I swear it's amazing. This, this is by Suba Beauty and this one are the UV eyeliners body art palette oh yeah okay this is uv primaries and this one is uv taffies this is where i have right now my eyes like i'm telling you maybe because i'm on camera right now i'm decent right now <laughs> because you know i will be applying this aligner all over my face like i create a different look every day and i love to play activate it with water i like to create uh, different eyeliners sometimes i have the whole line over here about my crease and you know I do have hooded eyes but I had no problem because I applied the liner all above my crease so when I open my eyes it's still you can see the eyeliner you know that's pretty cool so when my my daughter's at school right now but when she's here it's like we're constantly droning things in our arms in our face and it's so cool because you turn on the light and you kind of see like you know the UV like lighting it looks amazing, like illuminate in the dark, kind of like that. I love it. I love it. Okay, I'm going to show you. She loved this one. Look. 
and it comes with the aligner brush. And I, we're using this so much, and you can see that it looks like barely used. But yeah, we've been using so much. But you kind of can see the yellow there that is kind of mark all the digging in there with the, with the activated. I mean, with the water when we activate it. It's super cool. And there's this one, the primaries. Oh, what's this? I got this in uh, in Beauty Bay website. And I got them on sale a few weeks ago. I think I paid $19 for each palette. They have the palettes there and I did want to try them, but they were sold out. So I'm very happy that I got these ones for the body. It's super cool. The other day we were drawing like butterflies, um, stars, hearts, all kind of shape stuff, you know? So much fun me and my daughter with this thing. So I had them today as an eyeliner on the top, like very skinny line. And I had them here, the yellow light, the yellow primary over here, you know, like my eyes there. So you can see, it's pretty cool. <laughs> So it's the first time. I mean, uh, in the past I got these ones by Norvina, you know, Anastasia Beverly Hill, Norvina, her daughter. She came with these like um, activated liners. And I remember there was one that was like purple, white, and orange. And there was another one that was like green. I don't know, green, yellow, or red. I don't remember, something like that. And this stuff was cool, but after like a few days, I don't know. I felt like it wasn't so cool like this ones. Don't ask me why. I feel like this one's much better. She ended up discontinuing those eyeliners, but... And I got rid of them. I declared them. But I, I kind of like these ones, and I'm happy to have them in my collection. I had to hide them from my daughter because she's always coming here to open my drawer to play with them <laughs> and create things, you know? Um, so yeah, super excited. Okay, uh, another thing I want to show you that is actually on sale. I got this on, I got this like full price in Tarwick side, and now it's like on sale on Sephora for ten dollar. I think it was ten dollar, fifteen, fifteen dollar. This is the Tarte Energy Blush. It called Amazonian Clay Skin to Skin Skin Tweety Skin Tweety Twelve Hour Blush. This one right here. I'm obsessed with this blush. It's so pretty. Like that color. Look at that. It's like a light pink. Like kind of like bubblegum pink. It's so pretty. I swear. So I'm going to make you a swoosh. And it's very subtle. Like when you apply on your face, you barely see it. You know? Like you blend it. And it's so sort of look so pretty so this is one of my favorite blushes at the moment I also want to show you another favorite must-have blush this one is by Mac and it called desert rose this one is amazing for like medium all the way to deep skin this blush is so pretty like so pretty it goes so well on the skin and you see it like that but when you apply your face you have to be super careful because it's super pigmented you know what I mean like super pigmented. Okay, another thing I want to show you is my powder. Obsessed with this Sephora uh, face powder. This one is the Sephora Micro Smooth Multitasking Bay Face Powder. This is in the shade 33 Honey. If you suffer of dry skin and your skin is always peeling, this palette, this powder is amazing. Amazing, really me because the if you have like you know i'm suffering with really really bad dry skin and my skin to the point that get like start peeling and this powder oh it's super nice like super nice you can get some color and i mean it modify your your face but it's not so it's not heavy it's like a very light powder you know I love it. Another powder that I love is this one by Hourglass. And this one is the Ambient Lighting Powder. This one is in the shade Dim Light. I love the packaging. And these are like translucent setting powder, but also they give you this glow, like 
illuminate your face, you know what I mean? Oh, I love this. You can see. So beautiful. You know, I'm in love and obsessed with my NARS powder bronzer. Casino, well, Casino is discontinued. And um, this is Laguna 04, which is an, it's basically Casino. But, you know, now it's like Laguna 04. That's what NARS told me. So, I am obsessed. Like, obsessed with this bronzer. Obsessed. It's so, so beautiful bronzer. It's very natural. But also if you want like to be very bronze, you can reapply more and you're going to be like dark quick. You know what I mean? I want to show you my Dior highlighter. This is one of my favorite highlighter at the moment. This is the Dior Backstage Glow Face Palette. And it looks like this. It's such a beautiful, beautiful highlighter. I'm going to swatch them for you. It's kind of like a bronzy highlighter. It's very, very beautiful. And it has like some pink kind of sparkles in there. I swear it's so pretty. You can see there, they're very subtle. But when you apply them on the face, they can go very like strong, you know. So pretty. Really, really obsessed with this, the quality of this highlighters I love the texture and it looks super nice I love it it looks super radiant like I'm gonna take one right now like this one for example and apply it here so you can see you can see how pretty that is so pretty on top of my nose I got to use it with brushes like that because if I use like a smaller brush, it goes super blending, you know? But it's very, very beautiful. I love it. Another palette that I'm obsessed that came last year is this one by Pomegranate. And this one called... Um, it's gorgeous, I swear. The packaging is super beautiful. This one... Sorry, uh, it's upside down. Okay, this one is Pomegranate Labs Divine Blush Plus Glow Cheek Palette. New Venus says, look, this is the, I'm going to swatch the highlighter. You can see there. So beautiful and the blushes are so pigmented. I love, love this palette so much. I use it the entire year so much and it's like, I didn't even hit pan. And I was always using it. Like, it looks like I barely touch it. It's crazy. It's because the pan are so big. <laughs> A tons of product anyway um in love and i wanted like the other one the pink with the pink case and i couldn't get it because it was sold out last year but this year she came with that and i got that one so i'm very excited about that another product i want to show you is this foundation by nars and this is nars sheer glow this is in the shake of this i love this foundation because it's like light to medium coverage but to me it's almost like full coverage. I don't know. When I apply, I don't feel like it's just light to medium coverage. I feel like it's light to full coverage. Because it does cover like my acne scars. It does cover like some kind of like unevenness that I have my skin from the from the from the acne. Um I really love this foundation. It's 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 a sheer glow and it gives you that special glow and I love it, it looks very natural, it looks like you're wearing absolutely anything on your face, nothing. When I go outside, I only wear a little bit of this foundation with my sunscreen, it looks like I'm wearing no makeup and my face is all covered. Like, I love it. I love the coverage, I love how covered my foundation looks. I love that you set it with any powder, it goes so smooth, so well, it lasts me the entire day. I have nothing but to say about this foundation, I'm obsessed and I love it. it's one of my favorite foundation. My shade from, from summer, well, it was very, very dark, very tan because I went to the beach in Florida. So my shade for summer is Cadiz, which I'm still using, by the way. It's getting a little bit darker now, but I still use it like that. 
Um, and my shade in this foundation for winter is Barcelona. So I'm still gonna use that, but I had that, that foundation. I'm still gonna use it until my skin get lighter enough to apply that one. But I love, I love this one. I love in the shade Cadiz, and I just love in general the foundation. The quality of this foundation is amazing. I'm obsessed with this one and with the makeup forever. Okay, I'm obsessed lately with these concealers. And not lately, basically for more than eight, nine months, I've been using these two concealers. Um, I was using the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Ginger, but I ran out. I don't have that one anymore. I had the Caramel, which I'm also running out. There's ba barely any product there, but I keep scraping around there every time. And I keep reusing until nothing comes anymore. And I had the MAC Studio Fix 24-hour Smooth White Concealer. This one is in the shade NC42. Yes. I love this concealer, it's full coverage and I love to apply it like over here and it blends so well. It's like seamless, kind of like with like the one we nurse. They, they both like seamless, like, like you're wearing nothing and coverage so much. And the consistency is amazing. I love, I love, I love these concealers. They're like, to me, they're like the best. I want to show you these two lipsticks that I was wearing summer, in summer. I also used them in spring. Um, and sometimes I do use them. Now that we're in fall, I still use them. Um, this one is by Pam McGrath and I love the packaging. You can see that it's like a little cute heart over there. Um, this one is in the shade Amour. I'm going to show you. It's this beautiful like coral pink shade over there. It's like very vibrant and wow. It looks like matte in the packaging, but when you apply, you can see like, you know, it's like a, it has this sheer creamy texture and it's very, very beautiful. I do apply like a little and I just apply a gloss on top and it looks very nice. I also obsessed with this one by Lancome and this one is the 388 Absolute Rouge and I love this one too so pretty when i want like a very bright brown kind of like pinky red i go with this one you can see so pretty this one is a lip conditioner by mac and i'm obsessed with this my lips are always super dry and the only thing that helps my lips with this dryness um in this weather is this lip moisturizer by mac i try so many i try the one by Laneige. Um, I try all the brands out there, but this one is like the only one that I even try Aqua Four. And Aqua Four, Aqua Four is great too, but this is better, better for my dry lips. So I just constantly I had so many lipstick and lip glosses, but I was always using this because my lips are always super dry, and sometimes I forget to use it. And then when I'm gonna see next day, like today, my lips were all cracking. It's super annoying because it's like you have all these lips and I cannot use them. I cannot wear them because my lips are super, super dry. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs>